Portland police are investigating two separate shootings tonight, which sent two people to the hospital. And officers right now are still looking for the suspects. Let's get to Fox 12's Kendra Kent. She's standing by live with the latest. Kendra. Well, as we can tell you tonight that both victims who were shot are expected to survive. The person who was shot here in the Woodlawn Community Garden area is in serious condition in the hospital. That's according to Portland police. Now, as for that other person who was shot about eight miles from here, police said that person will be OK, but did not offer more specifics about their condition. Police say someone was shot here at Southeast 99th and Stark Street Thursday evening, and this work van was somehow caught up in the crime. Shattered glass on the street, and this Prius scraped up alongside. I had no idea. Julio Montiel now left scratching his head after quite the surprise to find his uncle's van behind police tape an hour after they parked here to catch a quick break in a nearby park. I think what I know is it got shot at. I'm not sure. Um, other than that, it looks like there's another Prius that kind of hit it. As for the victim, it's unclear if the person was targeted, but that person is expected to survive. Police say the shooter got away in a car and is still missing. Several miles north, more crime tape and another shooting earlier in the afternoon at Woodlawn Community Garden. Officers found a victim here too. That person is in serious condition at the hospital, recovering from gunshot wounds. A neighbor who didn't want to go on camera says she was walking her grandchildren home from a summer program at Woodlawn School when she heard what sounded like firecrackers and saw two guys in the middle of the park. Police are looking for that shooter as well. In both cases, officers have not released suspect descriptions, whether those involved knew each other or details about what may have led up to the shootings. However, officers did say the Bureau's robbery unit is investigating the shooting at Woodlawn. And the gun violence reduction team is investigating the shooting in southeast Portland. Anyone with information on either of these shootings should call Portland police. Reporting live tonight in northeast Portland, Kendra Kent, Fox 12, Oregon.